Hello internet, it's your boy the Goose. Welcome to another t video, t uh, food tasting video. Video tasting video? Yeah, we're tasting videos now. Mmm, delicious. But today we have some Nutella Go. It's gonna be kind of a quick one, because it's basically just their standard Nutella spread. Um, with breadsticks. So really it's gonna be a case of what's the breadsticks like, you know? Kind of see in there, all the sticks and the other uh, things. So I'm gonna have a bit of bread by itself. Mm. I'm not sure if that's great, to be honest. It's almost too, it's almost savory, which is weird. Maybe even a hint of salt. One well, of the breads that you'd have with like, you know, mozzarella cheese or, you know, at, um, at like a Italian restaurant or something before you have your main, or even your starters at that point. As I'm not tele receptacle, they're not fantastic. The crunch is good. You don't taste the breadiness of the breadstick anymore, but I think they're just too thin to really get any a good amount of Nutella on there. Also, the stick to Nutella ratio is a bit poor. Like, you don't really get enough sticks to the quantity of Nutella you're getting. And I know the layman solution to that is just, well, you just dip your finger in instead. But, um, what's it like with a snack together? It's. Very guilty pleasure, like, you know? Because this feels weird. This is barely one step up from um, eating just Nutella with a spoon. And I get that, you know, the Dairy Dunkers is kind of similar thing with the cheese, but the Dairy Dunkers you have very different types of the Dunkin' material, I guess. The Dunkin' things are dealing with very different types. And even the plain breadsticks there, I think, gel better with the notion of a dip being cheese than this. And again, the dippers for Dairy Dunkers are thicker than this by, like, a lot. They're about twice the size of these, and they're not all broken up in the bottom of the thing. I mean, I know it's probably because of transportation and whatnot, but, you know. It's hard to dip something that's broken in half. But, um, I'm going to finish this whole thing here, I think. I am getting a bit of a mess on them, so which is kind of not the point of, um, not the antithesis, really, of having a dip. Dippy boy. Mm. Mm. Um. No, I got this from my nan, because my nan just had them in the, uh, the cupboard of hers, and she didn't have any, and, um, she was intending to give it to me later. So I didn't pay anything for it, but I know that these are kind of not cheap. And... Well, I don't normally evaluate these things based on price. I will in this case, because... Fairly standard, to be honest. It's like a 5 out of 10. It just feels weird to have this as a product. 
It just doesn't, just doesn't, doesn't quite sit right for me. I don't know. It's a bit weird. And it's not exciting, because it is just an Nutella with breadsticks. I was hoping that I could have some epiphany upon tasting this and be like, oh, I get it now, I understand. No, I don't get it. I don't get the hype. I like Nutella, I really like Nutella. I just don't get this. I don't get it. It's a five out of 10. It's basic. It's vanilla ice cream levels of basic, you know? On that bombshell, I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. We've got something interesting lined up for the next few videos and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye for now.